Hey, Matt, how did it feel to push forward this type of performance tonight? And what does it say about the group and the coaching staff that you continue to get better throughout the course of the series? Best ser a game of the series, obviously, on the power play, PK, and five on five so far. Yeah, it was a great effort uh, all around, like you said, all facets of the game. I think we uh, understood the significance of this game. Uh, you know, makes a big difference, 3-1, 2-2, heading back to Washington. So, so uh, you know, it was a great effort all around. Uh, especially on the PK, um, you know, obviously Tuca uh, played an unbelievable game, but, um, you know, some of our right D, Brando, Cliffy, uh, Millsy before he went down, uh, Chucky too. Um, Fords did a great job. I think that, uh, you know, obviously we want to stay out of the box, be a little more disciplined, but, uh, you know, we buckled down when we need to and got a huge win. Matt Vator. Matt, you guys, uh, when the game, when Tom Wilson got Brendan Carlo, you guys responded with five goals and kind of dominated that game. This game you, is kind of a similar onslaught. Does that say something about your kind of your poise and your character as a group that you're able to channel your frustration about a play into into a, an overall performance like that? Yeah, for sure. Uh, you know, you, you never want to see a hit like that. Um, Mills is a huge part of our team. Um, he sticks up for everyone. So we wanted to do that, uh, you know, for him and, uh, making sure that we're doing it the right way. We're beating them on the scoreboard and not taking stupid penalties. Uh, you know, obviously we, we got caught in the box a couple too, too many times, but um, we responded when we needed to. We, we played the right way for most of the game and, uh, you know, it was a great effort. Tim Rosenthal. Hey, Matt, just in, uh, take us through that mill stands of what it seemed was like in the locker room in that six secondary mission as uh, you processed everything with Kevin and the overall heightened emotion through that time? Yeah, I think, uh, you know, like you said, we just try to regroup more than anything, um, especially in the playoffs, such a big game like that. You can kind of get off track, but we have a lot of great leaders in that room. And, um, you know, everyone made a point to kind of refocus and uh, we had a power play to start the next period. So, want to make sure we capitalize on that and obviously the unit did a great job getting us going we just kind of rolled from there Kevin DuPont Matt it takes until the third period of game four for either team to have more, more than a one goal lead when it's when it's 2 -0, 3 -0, did you did you get a sense of relief was there any sense there that you could relax or, or was that dangerous yeah no not at all especially against a team like that uh high powered offense um you know the, the number of penalties we were taking um, you can't let your left, leave your foot off the gas pedal there for a second. They can make you pay. So, um, you know, we, we've been through it before we've, we've been, uh, you know, on some deep runs and in, in the playoffs and we know what it takes when it counts. So, um, we lean down our leaders and, you know, we just try to go from there. Jimmy Murphy. Hey Matt. Um, hey. just the, the other game, the last game, it seemed like you were really kind of coming on with a little more emphasis to shoot the puck and, and create some chances in front down low. Um, how good did it feel for you to finally score uh, and for that to pay off? Yeah, it's always, you know, it's always fun to score, especially in the playoffs in a big game like that. It's uh, it's a great feeling, but, um, you know, especially as defensemen, I think, uh, you know, we try to make an emphasis going into game four to, uh, you know, to shoot the puck quicker. Um, you know, Forrest is doing a great job working them down low. Uh, you know, doing a good job of spinning off hits and, you know, not giving us, not giving it to us right away so that, you know, we can find some open space. And then we just try to get it to the net as much as possible. And uh, we, we did a lot, of, uh, you know, better job of that tonight. And, um, you know, I think it led to some chances, obviously, and we were able to sustain some, some zone time and, uh, you know, in their zone. And, you know, when they play man on man, I'm sure it's, you know, pretty taxing for them. So, um, you know, start with their forwards doing a great job down low, and as the would just try to you know help them out. Ian Steele. Hey Matt, um, your goal came after Tuca took uh, some contact. How good did it feel to score and kind of stick up for Tuca in that way? Yeah, for sure. Um, you know, Tuca's a huge part of the team, and uh, you never want to see a hit like that to your goalie. So, um, like like we said before, we wanted to make him pay. Uh, you know, the right way, not run around stupid. And, um, you know, obviously if they're going to keep taking penalties like that, then we got to make them pay on the power play. And we did a good job of that tonight. Last one, Julian Benbow. Hi, Matt. Nice shirt, first and foremost. Uh, <laughs> and, uh, 
uh, on the subject, uh, what can you say about Charlie and the way he's just, he just elevates, not only in this series, but all season? Unbelievable. Um, you know, he's, I can't say enough good things about him. I've, obviously, I got to play with him in college and could see from an early age that he's a special player. And um, he's only gotten better and better each year. Um, you know, biggest thing about him is, you know, when the spotlight's, you know, on him and the lights get brighter, uh, you know, Chucky shows up to play and he elevates his game. And especially being his partner, I want to make it sure that, um, you know, I'm supporting him. I'm, I'm putting pucks in good sport and, and good spots for him, uh, you know, to get going the other way in transition. I think we read off each other really well. So, um, you know, it's really fun to play with them. It's it's fun to watch, uh, you know, him grow up uh, kind of right in front of our eyes. He's one of the best defensemen in the league. 